You know, even though uh, you wear blue, uh, she and she wore black, uh, you both, law enforcement and her, spent your careers working for the same goals, to clean the streets, to have safer communities, and uh, for an uncompromising system of justice. You know, and I'm sure that many of your stories are similar to hers. Uh, the chief has uh, um, made reference to his days in the Bronx when we went to high school. Many of you probably grew up seeing the lasting damage that crime can do to a community. And you decided to spend your lives working tirelessly to put an end to that carnage of that damage. And now uh, you've gone through a career, a career witnessing firsthand the, the, the bruises on battered women, the track marks on young teens, the blood and the tears of the helpless victims of violent crime. You guys have seen it all. You've seen it all. And let me tell you, so has she. And it matters. Look, the law enforcement community, I think, in this country knows me. Uh, and I hope you give me credit for thinking that I get it. Well, let me tell you, she gets it. She gets it, too. She gets what you do every single day, day in and day out. She gets that one drug dealer in a corner, one rapist in a park is one too many and can terrorize and devastate a neighborhood. She gets what it takes to keep our community safe and our streets clean, and she has a record to prove that she gets it. So you all are on the front lines. But as you do your job, know that Judge Sotomayor has your back as well. And throughout this nominating process, I know you'll have her back. 